<clears throat> well, the cleanup from Thursday, August 7th is uh, pretty spectacular, and I couldn't wait till the weekend for it because I knew it was going to be really good. Sorry about that uh, for you who are waiting for a big, fantastic weekend cleanup fest. But that's my finds. The minus 20s are looking pretty good. I think that might go pretty close to an ounce. And I also uh, found some nice nuggets. Should put some scale in there. Give you a coin to reference it. But the uh, plus 20s, uh, quite a few also. some scale. Nice little nuggets. Pretty flat, but real nice color. And they should add up pretty good. So I think we're going to go well north of an ounce here. Might even challenge my all-time record of over an ounce and a half, but eh, I kind of don't think so. Still, spectacular. I'm very grateful. So there you go. I uh, did not get a video of the Latrap very much, maybe a six second clip on the camera with its internal memory because I forgot to put the uh, memory card in this morning when I went out. But I tried to take a real quick clip of it. If it's at the beginning of this video, it worked and I was able to download it. So there you go. I'm going to dry them out and we'll see what we got. Looking pretty good. All right, here we go with the big weigh in from August 7th. Thursday, August 7th, 2014. Now, I know I said I was going to do uh, kind of a multiple day cleanup on the weekend, but realistically, it's just not going to work uh, because I kind of need to clean up every day to see how I'm doing. Plus, as well, um, today was just an outstandingly, phenomenally good recovery day, so I couldn't wait. So we're going to go ahead and weigh up these minus 20s. I think it's going to go close to an ounce, if not... It might even go over, but it sure looks like it's going to get close to an ounce. And as well, today I found quite a few plus 20s. That's the little bit bigger pieces. And a goodly amount of nuggets. And one of them is actually pretty good size, although they're all, they're all pretty flat. Pretty flat. Uh, they will add up. So I'm looking at uh, maybe another ounce and a half day. Maybe it'll break my record of 32.4 penny weight. We're going to see. So let's start with the minus 20s. On with the scale. I've got a vial that's got about a half ounce in it from yesterday. Put that on the scale and zero it out. So we've got our zero reference. And now very carefully pour these minus 20s into the paper funnel. Quite a bit. Quite a bit. And I'm going to, I think I'll work over this empty pan just in case I slip a little bit. That way it won't contaminate the other stuff. See one little bit of crap I'm going to get out right now. There we go. Yeah, that feels like it sure could go an ounce. Let's see what we get. So we're zeroed out. I've got about an ounce and a half worth of room in this vial. So it should have enough room to contain the whole mess of today's haul. So in we go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I'd say we definitely topped an ounce. Man, I didn't even get it all. Alright, everybody in already. Okay, that's pretty unbelievable. I would estimate we are definitely over an ounce with just the minus 20s. Wow. Alright, here we go. On the scale. Yep, over an ounce, 22.4 penny weight of just the minus 20s. That's outstanding. 
22.4. All right. I'm going to add to my minus 20 vial. Let's see, how can I do this? Uh, so I will take my minus 20 vial, put it on the scale, and zero it. I think what I'll do, I need to get my nuggets separated somehow here. It'll be kind of tricky. Just for the moment, I'll scrape them into the other pan so we can weigh them separately and then add the plus 20s, which there's quite a few. There's got to be at least three penny weight there to add to my 22.4. It's actually going to get close to filling this vial up. Now the plus 20s. Okay. And two, three, three. They amount to 3.3 penny weight of the plus 20. So I'm going to jot that down here. Four. And now for the nuggets. Let's see, I can just buy kind of get them on the scale by themselves. We'll zero the scale. And we'll just count. We'll offset them well on the scale. Another three all by themselves. Anyway, well, it looks like another three point three away. All by eight. So I, I'm going to pay that big one on itself just so I know what it is. We got so there are 3.3 of the nugget, eight, which is a total not weight, most of 20 fine penny weight, almost an ounce and a half. Not quite my record, but really good. That's awful, awfully off these. Let me just put it, guys, and escape the song. Kind of curious zero of what the hell again. Biggest one. Just ain't curious as to any weight. The big one was 0.8 pin weight. And one of these other kind of chunk. I don't know, so four others are kind of chunky. 0 0.4. 0 0.4. So half eight. Little chunk fives for penny weight. Nice little key nuggets. Can add collection. Point five. A weak penny to the nugget and another point five half a weight. Cool. The nugget. So we'll add to the collection my ex nugget. Extensive. And that is collection. Hail. August is the tenth. We're almost filled up. Let's have a at, at twenty four penny weight up. That'll be a full ounce. So we've got about another eight penny weight out to go. Not enough if I can fit it in there. Sometimes the chunkier pieces don't settle down there. And, uh, and allow you to get one full ounce in the vial. Uh, Chef, I have a, an ounce by eight penny weight. Shop. Since the vial pays four, we take 24 to make it an ounce. But here's the real story. Almost an ounce and a half of fines. Or, uh, excuse me, just over an ounce of fines, 22.4 penny weight. From a full dredge cleanup that had three days on the bottom section. Still in good gold. I'm going to keep on going through it. And there you have it from August 7th. One grateful miner. The river is providing. Thanks for subscribing. Give me a thumbs up if you like the video and leave a comment. And I will see you on the next video.